we've just been traveling a while now, and I figure there hasn't exactly been equitable distribution of information. We've gotten a decent glimpse into your dirty laundry, but you still don't really know a whole heck of a lot about me. I figure that offer to balance the board. So, anything you want to know? So, so who are you, Nick? That's a question I've been trying to figure out myself for a long damn time. I know I'm a synth, authentic institute handiwork, but I'm still mechanical, not bioengineered like the fancy synths giving everyone the willies these days. I get tune-ups now instead of checkups. But my memories, my personality, they're all lifted from some cop who volunteered for an experiment back before the war. They scanned his brain and copied it onto the hardware that runs between my ears. I don't know why they chose to make a robot based on some pre-war cop instead of a math genius or a bioengineer. Hey, maybe that's why the Institute tossed me in the garbage instead of turning me into one of their people snatchers. Wait, the original Nick was from my time? Sure was. Which meant, when I finally ended up out here, it was quite the rude awakening. I remember waking up one day in a garbage heap, a body in tatters and a head full of memories belonging to a man who'd been dead for 200 years. Suffice to say, it was a confusing couple of weeks. Folks didn't really know much about synths back then, so when I finally ran into people, they mostly treated me with caution rather than hostility. But the kids, <laughs> they weren't afraid. I think his name was Jim. The first person to actually speak to me after I got the boot from the Institute. My first human contact in this world. Grilled me for an hour. <laughs> Once they'd seen I wasn't gonna hurt anyone, the other folks in the neighborhood came out to ogle the mechanical man. It eventually turned into a pretty swell soiree. A local mechanic even gave me a once-over free of charge. Those people, they treated me like a human being. I've been trying to return the favor ever since. It's a surprisingly rare trait out here sometimes. It's something I've noticed you got a fondness for. Part of the reason I've stuck around this long. If you're good to people, they'll be good back. That's something I've always believed. Couldn't agree more. Well, I expect you're about as bored as can be listening to me rattle my skeletons. You should probably head out. Abraham. Hey, you! Oh, sorry. Thought you might be one of those forged maniacs, but you don't have the burns. A group of them took over the old ironworks, and they'll shoot you just as soon as look at you. I'm with the Minutemen. Tell me what happened. Maybe I can help. Well, I'll be jiggered. Didn't really expect anybody to come. That bastard son of mine, Jake, snuck out in the middle of the night to join him. He grabbed my granddad's old sword. It's the closest thing I've got to an heirloom. If you really are with the Minutemen, and you want to help, well, it would mean a lot to me if you could get that sword back. That's, that cares about the, the sword, that's funny. What about your son, Jake? You don't care what happens to him? I didn't raise my voice to be Raiders. As far as I'm concerned, he's dead to me. Can you tell me anything else about the Forged? They're led by a guy named Slag. Came in from outside of the Commonwealth a few months back and started recruiting. Mostly they've just been strong on the folks. But with how quick they've been growing, it's just a matter of time till the raids get worse. I'll find it. You're doing me a big favor. 
and I'll make it up to you as best as I can. Okay, this is an actual useful mission here. So, with our freshly found power armor, the good news is I know exactly where that's at. Because it's right next to this log. <sighs> I'm one shy at will. The trader is out up here. I really need some, uh, some stimping up here. So, we'll be able to call in an airstrike. It's going to come out of the fog and ruin people's days. Pretty lucky. All the external uh, guys have been killed already. Looking that way. I don't remember how to play this out where the guy doesn't get killed. But we'll try to use our instincts here. Something out. Not that it's an Anything useful? I don't think we're walk away. Someone up top is throwing fiery things at me. But we'd prefer if you did. Well, they certainly do like to go through ammo, don't they? Uh, give me a mark here. Oh, hello. How are you? Well, you guys like fire, like, right? That's, that's like your thing, isn't it? It's like a whole deal. There's the... Those who failed the forged. Well, we can peruse that when people aren't trying to kill us. Nicely done. Now, which way are we supposed to be working it now? Probably over that way. Of 
By how much? Three. It's a quick meal. That's an old way of doing it. But we'll come back through here at some point. Don't even have to hack it, nice. I do this only because it would get me bonus points. Bonus points with the synth. Come on. I think the whole like with like blah, 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 blah. the whole likeness thing is just completely broken. Yes. Oh, sorry, done. See that see hopefully that got me an extra like. That was apparently just a way to bypass uh, somewhere. I think I just doubled back. Yeah, I definitely doubled back. Come on, which way are we going? Which way are we going? Okay. Get through here. That's to the Commonwealth. That's gotta be the wrong. Well, that doesn't make any sense, then. We come in here. I don't want to take a blowtorch, but I'm out of room. And it's a short pipe rifle. They're garbage. them later. Where in the heck? Well, I'll use up a little bit of core, but I'm getting impatient here. Is something through here? Someone's finding something interesting. So you work your way through. I'm going around in circles. Completely. Now, the local map doesn't usually do anything, but... So it's telling me I have to work towards a 90 here. Check the decay option, we'll bring gig. Okay, so let's work our way this way. Somehow we have to get past this stuff to the left, so maybe we 
Here you have to lose the high road. That's encouraging. Try. And some will get up that way. This is totally frustrating. Let's go up top here. Cut across and go straight through there. So up here, through here, oh, okay, this is interesting. How did I miss this? It was like completely difficult. There's an exit, okay. This is where it gets interesting. Someone who might actually be worth my time. Unlike you. But, You're gonna kill me. But I brought everything you asked for. Stealing things from your family farm doesn't prove your strength, boy. Though this wonderful sword you brought does put me in the mood to give you one last chance to prove your worth. What do you say? Kill that prisoner and prove that you aren't completely useless. You said we'd be waiting outside the Commonwealth. These people aren't even a threat to us. Prove to me that you can kill! It's him or you. Oh god, what do I do? What do I do? Please, let Walk me go! Away. What's it gonna be, Jay? To You're right. I don't want to do this. I don't want to join the war. I just want to go home. Last chance, Jay. Oh, Okay, let's load that. Help. He tries to leave. Kill him. Pretty strong to be here. It was easy. Most of them were never going to be worth forging in the first place. See, Jake? Here's someone who might actually be worth my time. Unlike you. But they kill me. But I brought everything you asked for. Stealing things from your family farm doesn't prove your strength, boy. Though this wonderful sword you brought does put me in the mood to give you one last chance to prove your worth. What do you say? Kill that prisoner and prove that you aren't completely useless. You say we'd be waiting outside the Commonwealth. These people aren't even a threat to us. Prove to me that you can kill! It's him or you. Oh god, what do I do? What do I do? Let's try one about your room. Please, That's always the good one. 
What's Walk it gonna away. be, Jake? You don't have to do this. You're right. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do it. I just want to go home. Last Hope chance, you Jake. Can opener. If you don't kill the prisoner before I count to three, well, it's over. One. Help! Two! Three! Not enough, asshole! Back up a little. Take care of this person. Where the heck is this person? I, mean, I literally don't see them. I don't know what I was thinking trying to join them. Look, I, I should probably try to go home and make amends. I know I've got no right to ask, but I bet if you're there to explain, things with my dad would go easier. I bet if you bring my great-granddad's sword, he'll make it worth your while. He always tries to deal fair with people. I'll wait for you by the overpass near the farm. The nice thing about this is it will hopefully get rid of these forged. It'll stop bothering the slug. The best part is I think I got everybody out alive who I was supposed to get out alive. Follow me. Just over here. Follow me. Just over here. Okay. Uh, I'm a following. You're dead. Who's there? You're playing games with me, huh? Look at all this blood. Someone's coming. Oh, hey. Someone's got himself a little armed up. I guess he is. Ooh. Where was the bad guys here at? Uh, no. Abraham, your son is a grown man. And if you expect him to act like one, then you'd better stop treating him like a child. Jake, your father and I have been out there. And we know it can be dangerous. We just want to make sure you're prepared. There. It's over. I hear another word about it from either of you, so help me. Lost a little there to the strange lag I'm having. She's right, I've been a fool. There's no way I can thank you enough. Okay, you might listen. Caps we agreed on. Plus a bit for help. I think you should hang on to that sword. It'll put a smile on Granddad's face to know it was being used to help people. 
I just want to trade a few things. Hmm, talk to Preston Garvey. We did it! We got the guy home safe. Hey. Thanks again for getting me out One of these days, we need to find you a good woman, Daniel. Even if I had time for something like that, which I don't, who'd be interested? A woman of the Commonwealth ain't exactly light enough to be farmer's wives. Then you need a farm girl. There's plenty out there, you know. That Abernathy girl is nice enough, even if her mother's a witch. And there's that girl at Warwick. What's her name? Joni? Jane. And she's too young for me. And Lucy Abernathy's only got eyes for Hawthorne in Diamond City. Well, don't you worry, son. There's someone out there for you. You're the one who's worried. I can't think past all the weeds I gotta pull. We, we had, had a good, good supply, supply of clean, clean water. water. Things, things would be pretty good. good. Okay, is this... Let me see if this happens. Ah! Great. They're my problem now. <sighs> well, let's get started. Something was just quickly slaughtered. I think I want to set up a uh, supply line from the slot, because they'll have to go right past the, the ironworks, and if they respawn, it's going to be all oh, just nothing but trouble and trouble and trouble. Interesting. We're in some real trouble here. I hope you can help. Hey there, friend. We're in some real trouble. Maybe you can help. What do you need? It's these damn greenskins. The super mutants. <sighs> Whenever they come through, we just have to run away or hide. They take everything they can eat and destroy most everything else. Uh, but you're surrounded and by machine guns. By surprise. Machine guns. They'll be dead. And lasers. They live like this. And lasers? Please, you've got to help us. Did you mention the lasers? I'll take care of those super mutants. I promise. Good. Oh, we're leveling Valentine. We're going to do. Oh, break hard banks again. Okay. Break hard banks isn't too bad. Let me just dump off all this junk. Quick reminder, my plan was to quickly do that one task and then go find robots. <laughs> 